Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. I have not filmed in so long and I feel like every single time I get to film in a video it's like long and far in between. I'm so sorry. Um, but today is Saturday and my husband's not home and I've got up the energy to get myself together and charge my camera and film for you guys. So today is a very, very exciting video as you can tell from the title. I'm going to be sharing with you guys my first Louis Vuitton um, and then it's also going to kind of be a how I organize my bag slash what's in my bag. Um, I asked some of you guys on Instagram if you guys were interested in seeing how I, um, I guess, pack my Neverfull and a ton of you guys said yes so I've been dying to film this video. I've had this bag already for I want to say about three weeks so I've been dying to film this. <laughs> Also, I'm sorry if my dog starts bark starts barking. Um, he barks at like every little thing he hears, so and he's kind of loud. He's laying on his bed right now, so hopefully he stays pretty quiet. And I actually might film two videos today, go me. So let's just get into it. All right, you guys, here is my baby. She's ginormous. <laughs> And this is my Louis Vuitton Neverfull MM, and she is, well you can't even see, but she is packed. I have a ton of stuff in here, um, and then I have my Lauderay keychain, of course. Um, a little backstory with this bag. I just came back from vacation about three weeks ago. Um, my husband and I took a trip to Europe. We went to London and we went to Paris for our first time. Paris was amazing. I cannot wait to go back. It was just way more than I dreamed it would be. It was amazing. Um, and on that trip um, prior, I decided that I was going to be purchasing my first Louis and what better place to do it than in Paris. The experience was amazing. If you guys follow me on Instagram, um, I did do some posts with the photos and buying my bags. You guys already saw that. So I got the MM size with the rose ballerine interior. You guys know pink is my favorite color. So let's just dive in. I have a ton of stuff in this bag. Um, and for the most part, I only carry this bag pretty much Monday through Friday. I take it with me to work. And then I'll show you guys the smaller bag that I have been using on the weekends just to kind of go out and about, do some errands, stuff like that. So let me try and hopefully get everything in frame here. So I'm just going to kind of pull things out. The first thing that I have in here is my Apple Watch box and my... Um, strap. I just got an Apple Watch yesterday, today's Saturday, so I got it yesterday. I'm really excited. I actually think I'm going to film um, either an empties video after this or a monthly or current favorites, not sure yet. Um, but if I don't do a favorites, my Apple Watch is one. So that's in there because I purchased it yesterday. And this is what the inside looks like and I purchased um, one of these organizers on Amazon. If I can find it, I will put it in the link down below. Hopefully, there we go. Hopefully, I'm not too green. I might have to fix the settings. So, let me see if I can try and pull out the organizer. And I'll show you guys what the inside of the bag, oh, I have some stuff in here, <laughs> looks like without it. So the inside of this bag is basically a huge bucket and it has a little pocket on the inside and then it also comes with this kind of clutch you can um, disconnect it from the inside and this is what I use as like my weekend on the go bag um, and then during the week I have it in here with some uh, stuff I'll show you guys what's in there after and you move this paper to the side somewhere. <laughs> this is my organizer. Again, I got it on Amazon. And the first week that I had the bag, I was just throwing everything inside of it. And right away I started to notice the bottom is looking a little saggy and I definitely wanted it to um, keep its beautiful shape. So I went on Amazon and I purchased this organizer and as soon as I placed it in my bag, I noticed it kept a beautiful shape, one, and two, my stuff wasn't just thrown all over the place. So 
let's see should we start yeah we'll start with the organizer and then I'll show you what I keep on the side of the bag so it has a ton of pockets and then this little section is velcroed in so you can actually take this out but I kind of like the divider I don't actually put anything in here because the zipper is kind of janky and it gets stuck um, See, like I can't even zip right back up, but I use it more as a having some issues, more as a divider for the bag. All right, I'm just gonna leave that there. There you go. I don't use the middle section, um, but you can if you hear the velcro and you can take that middle section out. But I like the you know, have everything divided. So I'm going to start and just pull things out. In one of the pockets, I have some. Peach Honey Tea from the brand Simply Balanced Organic. Um, if I'm at work or if I'm somewhere and I just want some tea, that tea is delicious. I have my Kate Spade planner, of course. I carry that with me everywhere. And then I have a photo album that I keep all of my stickers in. And what is this? This is an envelope from Stitch Fix. I got my first Stitch Fix uh, about a week ago. And it comes with just some papers and um, for some reason I just stuck it in there and never took it out. So that's that. And then on these little inner pockets, I have a Bath & Body Works Warm Vanilla Sugar Body Lotion. Vanilla is my all-time favorite scent. And then here I have a mirror. And let me show you this because this mirror is beautiful. So when we were in Paris, we went to Versailles and uh, I bought this mirror there that is supposed to be Marie Antoinette. And I just thought it was so beautiful. I love the design. And it's just a really nice slim mirror. So that's super pretty. I have a Nivea smoothness lip care lip balm and that's all I keep in that little section now on to this section I have way more stuff in here so I have more pockets if I can reach in there I have a Bath and Body Works peach Bellini hand sanitizer I actually switched out my sanitizers and there's still a ton left in this one so I have it there so I can use it up and I have some Trident Tropical Twist gum. This is my favorite gum. I love how fruity it is. And then here I have a Petco gift card. Um, my dog's birthday was a little over a month ago and somebody got him that, so I need to take him to Petco to buy him something. I have my key card for work to access my building. Not gonna show you that. Um, I have some gum wrapper. And then that was just like the little side pockets. As you can tell, there's a million pockets in this thing. And then now this section is just kind of open. So here I have a pink taser. My husband got me this. I live in LA and it makes him feel better. It makes me feel better. And it's pink, so, and it has like a little flashlight on it and it comes with the case. I usually take this with me when I walk my dog or if I'm walking home from the gym because it's usually around 7.30 at night um, and I don't want to walk around alone. Next is this little case. This is from a brand called Welly and it actually came with these blister, round blister band-aids that are amazing if you're like breaking in new shoes. Anyways, I bought these for the trip and I pretty much used them all so I decided to use this as like a little uh, storage case. So I have a travel native coconut vanilla deodorant. This is amazing. It smells so good. I have a million hair ties <laughs> because woman. <laughs> and I have some band-aids just because you never know. I have some mini band-aids and then I have one left of the healed band-aids which I wish I had two because what's the point of having only one but whatever it is what it is so let me just stick that back in there and I just like to kind of keep this together it's kind of like my emergency kit I have a gold bond healing cream this is my all-time favorite hand cream uh, aside from the L'Occitane hand cream 
This is way more budget friendly and affordable and it feels so good. I have my keys with a cute little pink bow that I got from H&M and then of course my AirPods, pink everything. Uh, next are my sunglasses and these are from Tom Ford and I'm obsessed with these. I don't know the style. Um, I do have, I think I have the style number on here so I will go ahead and put that down below. But I love these sunglasses, especially if I'm out and about running errands. Um, I love these on days where I don't have, you know, my makeup on and I'm just trying to go out and walk the dog or go to Target or whatever it is. Obsessed with these. Great purchase. Um, I have a Target reusable bag. I actually work literally across the street from a Target, which is really dangerous. Um, but I'm probably in Target like once a day, so I always have my reusable bag. Um, a gum wrapper <laughs> and this other little side pocket I have important credit information I have my receipt from T-Mobile for my watch and I have this notebook this is also something that I got at the um, Versailles and oh, I just thought it was so beautiful it's a cute little notebook um, I started writing down my monthly favorites. I haven't used the actual paper in the notebook just because it's so beautiful. I almost don't even want to use it, but the imagery is gorgeous. I just, I love that. It's so pretty and it's super little. I don't know if I'll ever actually use it. It's more to just kind of keep and it's beautiful, but I keep it in here. I don't know why when I don't use it, but I love it. So let me put all this back. And I'll show you guys what's in the rest of my bag. Okay, so I moved aside the little compartment holder. And we're going to go to the inside of the bag. So let me just unhook this. This bag really is never full. And for as much stuff as I carry during the week, the bag itself, because it's just literally a bucket, um, it's not really all that heavy, which really surprises me. Um, so the bag also comes with this beautiful, beautiful, I guess you can call it like a clutch or a wallet. And it has a little hook that it hooks into the bag or you can take it off and use it as like a really pretty wristlet. Um, the detail, of course, has the rose ballerine pink on the inside. And this I use, of course, everything in here I usually take out um, if I'm using it on the weekend. But everything in here is kind of also like an emergency stash really random stuff in here so I have a hangover patch and it has like vitamins and stuff in it this is actually really amazing I'm not really a drinker um, I mean I drink occasionally um, not like I used to when I was 21 <laughs> um, but I got this for like a family party or something and I had an extra so I just always carry it with me because you never know um, I have two packs of emergency I love those I try and drink one once a day but it doesn't always happen I have a couple packs of Tylenol I have two pens these are the paper mate ink joy gel 0.7 I love these pens I have a travel size bottle of poopery you guys know what that is um and a tampon so and when i take this out on the weekend usually i can fit like my phone my wallet um whatever lip product i have on and um oh i have another another tylenol and a panty liner um so it fits like a decent amount of stuff but i still don't overpack it when i'm running errands because i don't want it to be bulky i still want it to lay kind of flat because it doesn't look nice when it's like over stuffed and over packed so that's my little emergency kit i'm pretty sure every woman has one of these in their bag and because my bag is ginormous i can definitely carry this around with me and onto the inside of the bag i don't think i have much in this little pocket but let's explore so i have my birth control pills obvious um Move this out of the way. 
I have the schedule for my gym and all the classes that they have. It's a new month. We just hit um, June already. I can't believe it. And so every month they have classes. I have my Kate Spade card holder, which I've had for I think a couple of years now. Another hair tie. More gum wrappers. And this. So we went to visit a, um, I guess a church out in Europe. It was beautiful, so beautiful. And um, I bought this rosary just to keep with me in my bag. The pearls are a gorgeous pink. And I just kind of keep that in this little bag and you know, carry it with me. So beautiful. So I keep that in that little pocket. I should probably put my hair tie elsewhere. And that's pretty much it. Yeah. So when I'm, you know, like I said, on the go, um, I'll put my wallet in here and it's a really thin card case so it doesn't take up a lot of space. My phone's charging, but I'll put my phone in here. Um, again, my lip product that I'm wearing, um, maybe some lip balm or like some gum. And I'm gonna go out the door. So I love that this bag have the options of having like the full bag that you buy and then it comes with this which this on its own on the website I think is maybe like three to four hundred dollars it might be a little bit more than that I'm not positive but I love that it came with this because it was like getting two bags in one so let me just put the insert back in here um, and the organizer also I love because it really helps you keep Pretty much the bottom of my bag clean which is what I want again I'm terrified of getting anything in this bag or getting it dirty because it's such a light color and um, I don't want to ruin the bag and try to clean it and all of that stuff so let's just stick that back in there on the side um, and then normally in one of the little pockets I'll also throw on like my lip color um, my lash curler I just did my makeup so it's on my counter another hair tie and usually I'll have like a hair clip or something just kind of thrown in there but this bag literally carries everything um, it was definitely great for my first purchase for my um, you know my first Louis I use it Monday through Friday and she's perfect <laughs> so if you're thinking about getting a tote bag and you're thinking about investing in your first Louis I say do it. <laughs> I have no regrets whatsoever and she's perfect. So that is what I keep inside of my bag again Monday through Friday and that is pretty much it. Thank you guys so much for watching and until next time I'll see you guys later. Bye.